Hi everyone, today I'm unboxing and reviewing the Jiku G90 Bluetooth wireless headset. I previously reviewed this one here and I liked it. And so we're going to check this one out and see how things go. So um, I will put stats up on the screen for you to see. I'm not going to read through all of this. Um, it'll be in the description, and like I said, probably right now you're seeing a screenshot of some kind with all the statistics on the back. It is compatible with PC, laptops, uh, PS4, PS5, and it's got all the specs that you may want to know. Okay, let's open it up. And Jiku's packaging is normally pretty simple. So there's the manual, and it just comes bubble wrapped. That's it. All right, so let's take it out of the bubble wrap. And there's a few accessories in here. You get a dongle if you don't want to use Bluetooth, and of course, a charging cable that's got USB A on one side and USB C on the other. So the headphones themselves, they're very lightweight. Um, they're about eight ounces. Yeah, they were eight ounces when I weighed them. And the previous model that I reviewed weighed in at 11.3 ounces. So these are three ounces lighter. That's quite a difference. And you can tell when you put them on. The earpiece is swivel, 90 degrees. And I really like how you can see inside which way it goes on. Because sometimes, you know, especially if you have your microphone pulled out, yes, it does have a removable microphone. If you have your microphone pulled out and you're going to grab them, you can't always see, and then you're kind of looking for a little marking or something. This is highly preferred. I like the extra touch there. The padding feels comfortable, and when I put it on my head, it really feels lightweight. No complaints there as far as that's concerned. When I paired it with my computer, I had no problems. All I did was turn it on, go into the Bluetooth settings on my computer, and it instantly paired and set itself up. I took these right out of the box. They were charged, ready to go, and I've been using them for a couple of hours now, and the battery is still going strong. I haven't gotten a low battery mode at all. I haven't... Tr um, bothered pairing it with the dongle. I mean, I have this dongle here from the white one. I don't know if they work together. It's not something that I've tested. I really don't intend to use this dongle because it's got Bluetooth built in and I'm fine with that. I know a lot of gamers are interested in the latency because they want to be able to hear what's happening on the screen and they don't want there to be a delay. As far as I can tell, I am not seeing any kind of latency with these at all over Bluetooth. So I'm very happy with that. Overall, I think this is a great product. I like the aesthetic. I like the way that it looks. I like this band that adjusts inside. There's Velcro there. And so you can just adjust it that way. The whole band doesn't adjust, just this kind of suspension band does. I like the way they feel on my head. They're lightweight. They don't feel too hot. And compared to this older model, they're much, much lighter. So if there's one feature I would like to see in these, just like with the G80 here, I'd like to see a corded option so that when the battery dies, I have a way to use these headphones. With these, once the battery dies, that's it. You can't use them. Um, but other than that, I have no complaints. It's a great product. And even if you're not a gamer, I'm not a gamer, I think you'll find uh, good use for these. So I give these a thumbs up, highly recommend them, check them out. There's a link in the description below where you can pick them up on Amazon. It's an affiliate link and I'd appreciate it if you were planning on buying these to check that out. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye. And there's a few little accessories in here. <laughs> of course, of course. And it's a spam call, maybe. Hello? 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 It is a spam call.